Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about Android phones and more specifically, I'm gonna show you how to sign out of your Google account on an Android phone. So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off, why would you wanna do that? Well, that's pretty easy. If you happen to have borrowed somebody's phone and then you signed into your Google account to look at their Google Play or maybe search Google or signed into Google Mail, or maybe you're giving your phone to borrow or maybe you're selling your phone. Either which way, you wanna be sure to sign out of your Google account on your Android phone. That's what we're gonna go over. Now this is a really quick and easy process guys, not a lot of steps involved, so be sure to stick around to the end of the video. So the first thing you wanna do is go ahead and open up your apps on your Android device. Once you're here in the app section, you wanna go ahead and look for settings. It's this little gear icon looking thing. Be sure to check my video description. I'll try to leave this instructions in writing as well. Once you get there, go ahead and click on settings. I'm gonna click there now. Okay guys, I went ahead and switched over to my settings and what you wanna do is scroll down until you get to accounts and backup. It's this one with like a little orange key, it looks like. Don't click on Google settings. So I'm gonna click on accounts and backup now. All right, once you hear this screen pops up and you wanna click on this top line called account, I'm gonna click there now. All right, guys, we're almost there. One thing I wanna let you know, if you're going to be signing out of your Google account on your Android device, be sure that you're aware that it's going to sign you out of Gmail, also Google, and also the Google Play Store. So if there's some kind of information you need to get out of there, be sure you check that before you sign out of Google on your Android device. All right, so once you're here in the accounts and you've decided to go ahead and sign out of your Google account on your Android device, go ahead and choose which account you're gonna sign out of. So I only have one Google account associated with my Android device, so I'm gonna click on that one now. Okay, I went ahead and click there, and it's going to show your Google email or your Gmail username right here. And this is where you wanna be, guys. Don't look at these two little white lines. You wanna look for this one, it's kinda of easy to overlook. It's called a remove account. That's the one you wanna click on. If you would like to sign out of your Google account on your Android device, I'm gonna click there now. Next, you're gonna get this warning letting you know the same thing we talked about earlier, by removing this Google account from your Android device, it's going to remove all of the messages, contacts, and all the other datas that are associated with your Google account from this device. If you're okay with that, go ahead and click this remove account. I'm gonna click there now. Next, the screen pops up and it's letting you know that device protection features will no longer work once you've signed out of your Google account on your Android device. If it's okay with you, click okay. I'm gonna click there now. Depending on which type of phone you have, this screen's gonna pop up. So I'm gonna go ahead and enter in my pattern or if you've used some of the other Samsung or Android security devices on yours, but I'm gonna go ahead and draw my pattern now. All right, guys, just a few seconds later, this screen pops up again that shows all the different accounts associated with my Android device. And as you can see, my Google account is now removed. So that's the easiest way I know how to sign out of your Google account on an Android device. If you happen to know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. But hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel. And I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.